Hello everybody, this is Michael Smiley again coming at you with another review video. Um, tonight I'd like to talk about Mary, Queen of Scots actually. <clears throat> oh. There we go. So, I really thoroughly enjoyed this movie. Um... And I've seen, like, a lot of complaints about one scene in particular, um, but I just want to throw out there that, um, so the actresses are amazing actresses, right? And whoever directed it did an amazing job with the direction, um... And I really love the pacing of it and the story. And they were able to fit a lot into this movie. Um, I do have some complaints about it. Um, criticisms is what I should say. The first being... Um, the first being the meeting that everyone else complains about. But... My problem wasn't the fact that the director or writers or whoever made the scene happen. It's the fact that they made Queen Elizabeth the first too weak. Because if they had an exchange in real life, Mary Queen of Scots and Queen Elizabeth I of England... Let's be real for a second. Mary would never have been able to talk to Elizabeth the way that she did in that scene. Elizabeth was way stronger than that. She would have probably smacked Mary in the head if that was the case. Um, because Queen Elizabeth was strong and very... She didn't take that crap from anybody. Um... So, that's my first criticism. It wasn't the fact that they put the scene in there. It's the way that it was handled. Um, my second complaint was about Queen Elizabeth I, <laughs> unfortunately. Um, so, to be clear, clean, um, yeah, Queen Elizabeth I of England is my favorite historical ruler to learn about, and I really feel like she was truly a magnificent ruler. Okay, She took the country out of its Great Depression and literally brought it to its greatest heights when it comes to military and um, money and really making it. I mean, it was called the Golden Age for a reason um, during Queen Elizabeth the First reign. Um, so, back on to the criticism. I don't understand what was kind of running through the writer's head or the director's head or what the issue was, but Queen Elizabeth was not that, uh, I don't want to say whiny, but, um, weak. There were, there were excellent scenes that Queen Elizabeth, uh, you know, that they did for Queen Elizabeth. And then there were others that just didn't make sense because it didn't fit Queen Elizabeth. I just don't even, I can't even come up with words about this. It's, it's just not the way that Queen Elizabeth I was. I'll just leave it as that. Um, the portrayal of Helen Mirren or Kate Blanchett um, and even at moments Rachel Scarston uh, portrayed her really well. I mean, she... Like, and it's nothing to take away from the actress, because the actress was excellent. 
the Margot Robbie. Um, she is amazing. And it wasn't her fault. Uh, because she is amazing. She's an amazing actress. I'm not, I'm not taking anything away from her ability and talent. I am just pointing out the fact that the way that the real Queen Elizabeth was, it was not the Queen Elizabeth in this movie. Um, the roles would have been reversed because, if anything, Queen Elizabeth I was the one that was more put, you know, men in their place or whoever in their place because she was a tutor. She really didn't care. She just, you know. <laughs> But I really did love um, the portrayal of Mary in this movie. I really do think that they did a really great job with Mary Queen of Scots in this movie. I do, I do um, feel that they did an excellent job there. So I can't, I can't take anything away from that because the writers did a great job there. Um, and I love how they fit a lot into this movie. Uh, and a lot of it was real events that happened, like, um, the murder of her servant, for instance. Horrible. That was a horrible, factual thing that really happened. Um, Rizzio. And, um, you know... It's sad, but great that they did put those real historical things in there. Um, so, I do recommend it, though. It is a really great movie. It's just, uh, the only complaint that I really have is um, the way that they made Queen Elizabeth I. And, um... And, uh the the way that they handled the scene where they met. I don't care that they made that scene. I care because of the way that they handled it. And there's just there's no reality where Elizabeth would have let Mary talk to her the way that she did. Um but that's real that's probably the harshest criticism I have about it. Um, everybody else has these criticisms, you know, they're whining and criticizing it for having Asians and black people in, you know, court and everything for that day and age. I don't care about all that stuff. I don't care. They're people, and they're filling in the roles of those people. And they were real historical, uh, people. Who portrays them? I don't care. I care about the story and the um, the way that those people were portrayed. Um, so there's that. Everyone has their own criticisms and complaints or whatever, but those are mine. I don't really care who plays who um, or anything like that. I care about the way that it, you know, how great it was done. I care about the, the story, um, and how things really would have went, I guess I should say, or how they actually did go. Um, <clears throat> the costumes were really great. Uh, the scenery was really great. They did, they just did a really great job. I think that they did a beautiful, excellent job at all that stuff. Um, so, there's my, there's my review about Mary Queen of Scots. I do highly recommend it. It is actually a really good movie. Um, no movie is perfect, but it is a, a good movie nonetheless. So, there's my review to, a review about it, so... Have a great night, everybody. Until next time, if you like my review, just like, subscribe, comment, let me know how you felt about the movie. Um, again, don't be a racist. 
if that's all that you care about, if that's what you took away from the movie, that's sad. Um, just talk to me about, you know, the story and how you feel it went, how good they did with that, you know, that kind of stuff. Or even the real life events that happen in the movie. We can talk about those because those are pretty sad in a lot of the cases, but unfortunately it's history. So have a great night, guys.